All right, so here's my plan for sealing the pond. If you'll notice that it's kind of low right now, I had drained it down to the top of the drain and uh, picked up some of the bigger rocks and I'm letting it kind of slowly fill up right now. Anyway, um, but if you look on the back side of the dam of the pond, we've got some seepage. It's not running or anything like that, but you'll notice that it's wet and this is the worst spot right here. So clearly, we are losing some water out of the pond and on the back side of the dam. you notice it's a little bit damp and green all along here. This pond was built back in July of last year. And as it filled up, it just started to seep. So what I'm trying to do is uh, I went ahead and bought several bags of sodium bentonite. I'm just trying the sprinkle method. They say it's less likely than draining the whole thing and hauling in clay, but I just can't afford to do it any other way right now. If it's low, we'll just have to live with it. But what we've done is we've bought these bags of sodium bentonite from our local MFA store, 50 pound bags, and I've been scattering them along the bank and uh, starting just where the seepage has occurred. And uh, now that I've got most of the big rocks out, I'm just sprinkling it, kind of like you spread fertilizer, but way thicker all along the bank. And I'm gonna try several hundred pounds of that spread out. And as you notice on the ground here, they're just little granules or clumps, but as soon as they hit that water, they expand quite a bit to faint this sort of slimy mud that seals pretty good. So I'll just keep sprinkling and keep sprinkling and hopefully at some point it'll seal that and we won't have any seepage. And I'll check back in in a few weeks and let you guys know how it worked.